Good evening, good morning, and good day. We are back with World of Horror. One more mystery to go. The doom is incredibly high, but we should be fine. This is the curious case of contagious coma. People falling unconscious. Good. Well, not good. But let's keep going. I'm really concerned about the doom, even though like most of it is my own doing, just pumping it up. But oh well, with the trail growing cold, it might be a time for a different approach. Could a similar case have occurred in the past? A trip to the library might be a good idea. Yeah, let's try this. I failed in this before. I succeed. Minus 3% doom. Excellent. Near closing time you stumble upon a curious article on the last page of a local newspaper. You copy the author's name along with the address before getting ready to leave. That is incredibly important. Okay, we go to investigate. Should we actually this time to get the B ending ignore this patient zero thing? Maybe? I'm afraid what it will do to our doom. But let's try that. It should actually save us on the doom. Hearing footsteps you turn around. Behind you stands a pretty woman in a sweater. Natural beauty. Yes, this is exactly what I need. You shudder, seeing the weird woman reaching into her pocket and producing a nasty looking knife. Pretty face. Mind if I borrow it? Oh, it's the model. The aspiring model. I'm a bit confused that you still see us as being pretty. With a broken nose and a face like this. I guess it's a competition whether you'll take our face or we will eat you. Okay, we can get a dodge in. Two stamina damage. That is way too high. That is way too high. Should we go for... What was it? What was the defensive spell? It's abolished. But this isn't Eldritch. We can't do that. Let's just try and trust our dodge, I guess. Ouch. Oh boy. Hello. Hello. Where's your face? Okay. I mean, we are dealing a good amount of damage, but it's four stamina per turn. What the hell? No, 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 no. Four stamina per turn. This is not good. We could gain some stamina. We are actually just going to die here. Twelve. I mean, we would have to hit only twice. Right? Surely we'll hit twice. Yeah, let's try this. Excellent. Wow, that was far too close. Wait, what's that? Lucky earrings. Okay. Equip for plus two luck. In C slot. We will lose some strength. But we should be able to do dodge and double attack anyway. I'm not sure what exactly luck does. Fancy earrings. Let's try and equip it. Will we actually lose the doom? We will. That is important. Okay. Good, we are fine. 
we are completely fine. Our infected wound is still infected. Let's go to the hospital and borrow some information about the patient zero. We recognize the... Okay. These branded people, we finally recognized symbols. Reduced doom. Oh wow, this is incredibly good. We could even afford to heal ourselves. Let's actually do that. Torn muscle. This isn't good. And we'll heal that. Heal the torn muscle. Excellent. Our doom is still managed a bit. We have healed up a bit. Gained some experience. Let's keep going. Consulting room. Sleeping nurse. You entered the hospital looking for information about a certain patient. The main corridor is dark and strangely empty. You spot a nurse at the registration booth. She's asleep from the exhaustion. Set trash can on fire? Why? Let's maybe sneak past her. Dexterity fail. You've managed to sneak past her. Unfortunately, the old cabinet squeaks loudly, waking the nurse. You're thrown out of the hospital, losing reason. It's unfortunate when we, even when we rely on our, basically the best stats, we are still getting failures. Okay, let's search the patient Zero's house. Okay, we have the gruesome altar in the restaurant, I guess. Let's research the occult notes, maybe. Should we call the police? Let's re research knowledge failure, really? Ouch. That is painful. We find a journal, but that isn't an item. Okay, I'm fairly curious to see, Betty Thief, you, while you walk through the crowded place, someone bumps into you and quickly apologize, realize what's happening. They stole your wallet, you quickly grab their arm and they drop it before disappearing in the crowd. Excellent, excellent perception success. I'm fairly interested what will happen in this hospital because we if we don't complete the village, we don't have the powder to make the enemies visible. Will we actually just fail to save these people? You stumble upon a nurse trying to open a door to the intensive care unit, constantly mumbling something. When she turns around, her face makes you scream in horror. Hello. Hello. Reason damage. Reason damage. Let's see what we have here. We can't get this going anymore. Maybe we should incorporate the dodge. And double attack. Yeah, this is the one we'll go for for now. We should be able to hit her. She has a very low power. And we managed to dodge as well. Let's just keep on going with this one. Nurse screams blasphemies. Ouch. Losing some very important reason that I should have just attacked. Ouch. Badly bleeding. Chance of losing one stamina with each investigation. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Just finish her. We should have been able to finish her last time if we didn't dodge. Oh well. Oh well. There it is. Let's hope you find an answer here. You've managed to sneak 
through the floor while avoiding the police and finally reach the coma reach the quarantine wing where all the coma patients were brought in. Their pulses are slowly weakening and their blood pressure is dropping. You must hurry. And this time we don't have the powder. We can't, won't be able to see the monsters. So let's try to investigate. <laughs> the complete silence of this place hits you when you reach one of the beds. All the patients are dead. Oh no. We solved the mystery in quotation marks. Shaken, you sneak out of the hospital. One thing is certain though, with no more sick people left alive, it's the end of this weird illness. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Sure. Sure. Old guardsters. The roads have been closed by the police. Okay. Let's go to the lighthouse, I think. I think I'll finish this now. Let's take a key. Double check that we don't have anything. Oh, we would have an additional mystery here. Why? Hang on. Can't we just go to the lighthouse? Why do we have an additional mystery? Maybe we should try that. I mean, it all depends on Doom. I will try to heal myself. We don't have much stamina. Try to heal myself. I'm double badly bleeding. Okay. Guess that's fine. Maybe I should try it again. I need more reason. Let's try it again. We are triple badly bleeding, okay? But we get a level up. Okay. Plus one perception, sure. Let's get maybe our strength up. Should we try that other mission or just dip out of here? I mean, we have all the keys. I don't think there's any reason for us to linger. Except for fun. Let's get out of here. We should be able to defeat this whatever it is need five keys we have five keys we shall enter the lighthouse excellent maybe access storage now we don't need the storage let's start Climbing. Should we maybe increase our reason just a bit? 2% doom. Excellent. Only one reason. Oh well. Let's start climbing. Oh, the janitor and Kana are going, coming with us. Okay. Winding staircase. A metal gate blocks our way. This is the acid one. Disconnect the faulty plug. We don't have enough strength. Once again, so we are burned. Do we get an injury? 
we don't we are so injured <laughs> we are so badly bleeding <laughs> okay just lose some stamina we are fine absolutely fine following the winding staircase you are stopped by a metal gate grab the metal rods knowledge check past you're about to grab the rods when you notice the dials and buttons you toy with them for a bit before adjusting both voltage and current so it's safe for you to grab them with a buzz the gate opens excellent our knowledge pays off oh hi delinquent girl i'm sorry i can't let you go any further she says reaching for her back it's too late anyways oh this is the one who will cut her own throat. Instinctively you take a step back when you notice a knife in her hand. You have to think fast. Not enough charisma and she slits her throat and falls onto the ground. Losing some reason there. But we are fine. We are completely fine. There's something waiting for you inside of it. We have a flashlight. White source seems to somehow repel the darkness and you continue to climb the staircase safe. Excellent. Following the winding staircase you find a metal gate blocks our way again. Well, this is different. It is locked but you notice an electrical cable. It seems to be connected to the door. Connect the door to a hole inside the central pillar. If there's a switch inside, you have to risk getting cut by numerous glass shards and knives. Let's find the switch, probably a dexterity check. You've managed to locate the door switch while avoiding knives and glass shards. With a buzz, the gate opens. I guess this isn't actually a check. This probably just checks whether or not you have enough dexterity. We probably do have enough. Continue climbing. Dark clouds swirl around the lighthouse. Did you arrive too late? This spider cocoon. Let's just kick it, I guess. Poof. That's a win. As the unnatural fog slowly lifts, you are relieved and collapse to the floor, probably from the bloody bleeding, I would assume. The next day everything seems like a bad dream. You've managed to stop the ritual, awakening the eldritch old god, but what's done is done. It will stir in its slumber again and again, until the stars are right once more. Congratulations, you are safe. For now. Excellent! The playthrough sure lasted a while. <laughs> I left the game on while I was doing completely other things. I mean, did I really leave it for this long? Who knows? Well, difficulty level cultist, yeah. Final log entries unlocked. Plenty of new achievements. Interesting. Medical history background cleared. Let's actually just check what our unlocks were from the achievements. Defeat an enemy with a baseball bat unlocks a flare gun. Interesting. Discover a hole in the painting, glass eye item. Okay. Pocket knife, I think we got this time as well. Okay. Be the school, right? 
Yeah, oh well. It's fairly difficult to say which one of these we got. Unlock city planning option. Wonder what is that? City planning option. Assuming that's a new game. Is it in options? What? Okay, it's probably the seed. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Did not mean to do that. Yeah, this is completely customizable. Who cares? I want to see the options. Want to see the options. Endless mode. Yeah, sure, fine. Wow, there's so many things to choose from here. This will be like really quite interesting to delve into but I want to see the options city there's nothing about city planning in the options oh well but I will exit the menu from here I hope there isn't like an achievement for getting multiple runs in a row it probably actually is okay anything here skip suitcase screen gamepad skip playthrough intro actually yes extra math extra information all of that would be interesting Can't see the city planning thing anywhere. Oh well. I guess that's good enough for this time. I'll see you next time. Sorry for waddling around at the end there. See you next time.